Hi everyone, my name is Red. I'm Dorkong's backpack. Oh, 가방이 너무 무거워. Oh my god, why are you so heavy? Building <laughs> area. So I heard some of you are wondering why I'm as heavy as a ton of bricks. Well, today is your lucky day because I am here to spill the beans. First off, you might be wondering why I'm chatting away in English. Well, I might have been born in China, but I've been chilling in the U.S. since I was really little. Sure, I got a few texts in Korean, but Mandu, Dorkong's hubby, bought me in the U.S. and I've been living here ever since. So no fancy language lessons for me, just good old English. As Mandu got his new backpack from work, and bam, here I am, Dorkong's trusty friend. Now, Mandu's backpack, that guy's from Patagonia, pretty dull if you ask me. But that froggy dude hanging there, he's a pretty cool friend. And that is Leonard, all the way from a line store in New York City. This is my backpack. I got it at work. Now, of course, every backpack that every person got is the same backpack. So you have <laughs> everyone walking around with the same backpack then when you want to find yours it's a problem so eventually we got this guy here hello now on to the burning question why the heck am i called red when i'm not even red well my friends that's a mystery even i cannot solve but hey think about it charlie brown is not brown and jack black isn't black so why can't i be red it's all about embracing who you are no matter what skin color you have. Am I right? Let's talk about why I'm lugging around all this weight. Was I born chunky? Nah, not really. I'm just on the tall side with some sturdy bones. It's all thanks to the robust laptop compartment of mine. Dorkong loves it, and that's why I'm always tipping the scales. Dorkong is the type to carry two to three laptops at a time. One is all locked up for her main work, Another is for her consulting side hustle with sensitive data. And the last one is just for her personal video making fun whenever she has some spare time. Okay, let's see what I have today here. She's always got her AirPods, or at least the case, she's notorious for leaving the pods behind. Hello, it's me. And just in case, she packs a classic trusty Sony wired headphone. Nothing fancy, just a $20 bargain from Amazon. She's got her journal, brimming with her deepest secrets. And a pen case housing her top three pens. One is from Itoya Japan, which is her go-to pen. Another, a precious Mont Blanc passed on from her mom at her doctoral graduation. It's so fancy that she's afraid to use it, but she carries it everywhere as her lucky charm. And of course, there is a mechanical pencil for her Spanish homework and some math. Oh, and she carries her idol's latest book here. And her wallet is tagging along if she's not in an Apple Pay mood. It's a fancy piece gifted by her sister. And then there is the usual suspects. Post-its, a pouch full of who knows what, it's not really her forte, and some snacks for those hangry moments. Down below, it's mostly for her lunchy box, but Dorko is not really big on cooking lately, so it's often a ghost town down there. Right. How come we have so little food? Now some folks may wonder if I'm green with envy over Dorkong's other backpacks. Take her hiking buddy, the Osprey Anti-Gravity 50. I mean, come on, define gravity, really? I might be a tad envious because she has taken him to Grand Canyon, Glacier National Park, Yosemite, and many more wilderness adventures. But hey, 
He's been stuck even more in the darker closet most of the time, especially since Dorko married Mandu. Side note, Mandu is more of an indoor type. What about her Adidas backpack for travel? Lightweight, petite, and cute. She's been all over the place. Seattle, Oregon, Korea, Japan, you name it. Sure, I'm a smidge jealous, but I've got my own gig. Howling laptops, tackling the heavy stuff, and sharing the load of life with Dorkong day in and day out. I've been there through thick and thin, from her first day on the job to helping her nail her biggest projects. That's it for now. Let's rock this day, folks. Dorkong and I are ready to tackle whatever comes our way today.